WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento with the Mid-Morning Update. Well, boys and girls, it's uh, up, up, and away in all of the tech stuff, folks. Uh, We've got Tesla, Amazon, Apple, even Facebook. Uh, The older Facebook is now mad. uh, Is uh, almost to the 382 retracement of the whole move down, folks. It was a good buy at 380 and even a better buy at 80. But now we're trading up at about 120 or something like that. No, it's not even that high. Uh, maybe 90. I don't remember exactly. All I know that it – no, it's, I think it's, it's up 100 and something, 180, 90. I think 210 is a 382 retracement of the whole thing. But all the markets are moving up with the good news from Facebook. And we have earnings today from Amazon. So all of that stuff is telling us that the markets are – you know, really moving, uh, you know, to the upside. So those are just a few things that we're paying close attention to. we got the S&P up 61. The Dow Jones is actually down 90, which is a sort of a big surprise. But the others are just hanging in there, uh, doing pretty much the same thing that they always do. Russell is up about 38 points, 400 points in the NASDAQ, folks. That is uh, near record territory, folks. So you've got to pay real close attention to that one. That's uh, that's really getting ready to uh, move up uh, up quite a bit. Also, we had gold just miss the price level yesterday at 1977 in the April gold, and uh, it dropped fifty dollars today. We're down at 1926. Uh, so we've got all kinds of things, uh, you know, happening in all these markets across the board. So we're going to keep a close eye on them as always, and. Uh, One of the things that we really need to pay attention to is the interest rates because we've got the bond market and the Treasury note markets are holding up relatively well given the fact that the Federal Reserve has told us that they're probably only going to raise the rates uh, a few times at 25 basis points. At least that was the rhetoric that was reported by uh, Bloomberg today. Now, whether that's going to mean much over a period of time, you know, we have to wait and see, but that's at least what we're looking at so far uh, here today. So, Keep those things in mind. A lot of things going on, as always. Give us plenty of time, you know, to act and look at our portfolios and see, you know, what you want to be looking at. But these big breakouts are being paid attention to by the news by a great deal of people. So we need to watch that. So we'll see you all on the flip side tomorrow. And stay tuned for Trade What You See. 